Archbishop, Metropolitan and Primate Church of Nigeria Anglican Communion, His Grace, the Most Reverend Henry Undukuba, has encouraged all not to give up on the current situation of the country, saying the greatest weapon against anarchy and works of darkness is the power of God that never fails. The primate gave this encouragement in an interview with reporters in Abuja, calling on religious and political leaders at all levels to come together in unity, overcoming every challenge facing the country. We have security challenges, economic challenges, and so many other things that are confronting us. But we want to encourage everybody, because the church also is part of the society. Uh, we are not um, separate from what is happening around us. If anything, we are also suffering it. But we want to encourage everybody not to give up. God has not given up on us. And we are trusting God that Nigeria will rise again. The role of the church should be to pray and also to teach the word of God. The greatest weapon we have against anarchy, against the work of darkness, is the power of God and His Word. He has never failed. So let us live true to our faith. Let us trust God. Let us walk with others. And we are praying that wherever it will be necessary for us to help our, the people around us, there is no help that is too small. Every local church, every community must, must come together to help each other. In times like this, we can only overcome by uniting ourselves together. And therefore, we, we call upon our politicians, we call upon our religious leaders, we call upon our, polit our, our governors and, and uh, our president and all in authority. Let us all come together and see that we do what we ought to do. We will overcome only as we unite together. But a situation in which there are infractions into our security, a situation in which we see clear compromise, a situation in which we see betrayal within our system, it is not acceptable. And therefore we call on both the military the, uh, and the politicians to begin to purge themselves. Let us be true. Nothing deceives or brings down a nation than deceit. Deceit in leadership will compromise the security, will compromise the integrity, will compromise the, the good work that needs to be done for the common good of the people. 